Cool. So what does it come out to, like, 12 hours or something? You can pull uh, a 12-hour shift? Where? On the, for the both crate? of them. Put them both together. Uh, yeah, 12 hours. Wow. That is, that is yeah. something else, man. You're it's like good. Superwoman. It's all good. And I tell you, man, you guys are the Fantastic Four, or Fantastic Two yeah. this time. Yeah. But you guys are really, man, energy to burn. I think we're going to look at it. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's a love fest. And then she has another uh, another good friend, Yolanda Chavez. Uh, well, that's what I heard works, about that. Works with, uh, her, helps her with the flan, and she is an awesome person. Pretty that, legendary, huh? Yeah, and she does it out of the grace, grace of the graciousness of her heart. How would I say that? So she's here in the audience. She's here in the audience. Her name is Yolanda Chavez, and she's a sweetheart. And and she's helped uh, Kiki tremendously. I try to help, but I work two jobs, and I try to. That's what I heard. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. So no, she did really good. She was coaching her too. Yeah. (laughs) Speak louder. (laughs) Yeah. And then we can hear her on camera. See, so it's beautiful, you know. Yes. They're looking at looking at and say, "Hey, this woman needs coaching." Oh, you guys are. Fantastic. I got to remember to say that. That's going to be the word. I'm going to be stuck with that in my head now. <laughs> Fantastic. They're going to put me away for sure. Okay, we're gonna, we want you guys to stay up here, and we're going to cut away to uh, a clip of a good friends of ours that we shot at the hop many moons ago. I think it was 1991 or 92. And this is the band with uh, Mario Flores and Eddie Farias, known as the Aliens here on El Monte tonight. So we'll be back with these two young ladies to talk a little bit more about them. Then I want to also do an interview with Mr. Robert Colvin because he's the unsung hero of El Monte tonight. And if we had more microphones, we'd get all you guys up here because we love y'all. Okay? So let's take it away back there in the Auto Control Room. The Aliens. Cuando la tarde tranquiliza, renace la sombra Y en la que tú los cafetales vuelven a sentir Se oye una canción de la vieja molienda Y en el estado la noche parece heavy Cuando la tarde tranquiliza, renace la sombra Oye una canción de la vieja molienda 
Muchísimas gracias. We are. Isn't that wonderful? And we got the three shot going on there. That was the band known as the Aliens. We had Eddie Farias just recently. He played with a band called Los Dallas with my other good friend, Luis Mendez. And hopefully we'll get another reunion episode with them coming up in the near future. So let me talk to these ladies. Then we're going to go with Robert Colvin because I want to find out some more. We got some more cheese man to go with because we have the Comadre show coming up. <laughs> And these, and these two, in fact, we're going to have to get your whole, your whole crew, man. So that could be a show in itself, a reality show, right? Oh, my God. Days of our flan. <laughs> Days of our flan. <laughs> or as the flan turns. <laughs> as the flan turns. <laughs> this is the way it works, yeah. right? So what do you think? Are you going to be interested in doing that, that episode with us? Sounds very interesting. Uh-oh, look at that. Non-committal. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Must be a Republican. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds interesting. <laughs> like if I asked her, you know, hey, can I borrow your car? Well, sounds interesting. <laughs> <laughs> no, because we like you, like I said, we'd like you to do like a little maybe a cooking segment when we do that, only because we eventually want to do a spinoff of a cooking show. And part of the show we want to do, and I'm giving away tales, okay, is that we want to be able to go around and review some of the nice restaurants we have here in beautiful Almani, get some of their best dishes, and highlight them on our show. Mm -hmm. And so you'd be chef slash food critic. Sounds good to me. Yeah, I, I know you'd love to criticize other people. I know she would. <laughs> Maybe she'd go for it. Man. You know, I could have done better. <laughs> well, you know, we never know. And then with uh, Sylvia, we are planning to have her maybe co-host our show, Amani Tonight. She said graciously she would consider coming on here once a month, which would be outstanding because she has a lot of personality. What do you guys think? Sound like a good idea? <laughs> Thank you. I mean, it's too much talent here. I mean, it's too much talent. These are very, very good spiritual ladies. And, you know, I mean, it'd be ridiculous to just turn them away. See, I mean, we're already grooming Arlene to be our house singer. That's See, right. she's ready, man, because let's hear yeah. for her. Come on, man. So, so, so we're sending a shipment of antibiotics to her house, <laughs> even as we speak, so we can get her well so she can come back on a regular basis. You know, not to steal Robert Colvin's thunder, because Robert is the walking thunder when he does this stuff. So that's mm -hmm. why I look at it. He's so, he's so modest. You know, this guy's an engineer in the daytime. This is really? a secret identity. Yes. Wow. Right, right, Robert? Yep. You did a round of applause. Right. Well, one of the most talented individuals I've ever been blessed to meet because he's got it going with both hemispheres of his brain, right? Me, I'm pretty hanging out to one. So I'm very happy with that one. But, you know, it's really great. So, you know, we're really looking forward to it. So we're going to turn on over to Robert, and then we'll come back because we're getting close to winding out down. What are we looking back, like back there on the timeline? Oh, you tell me that now. Okay. Here on Am I Tonight with Mr. Robert Colvin. Let's hear a round of applause for him.
great and eventually we'll get a camera person on us because we have two they, they love you see robert i mean gosh man i'm the host of the show and they had both cameras on you i don't read i tell you man hey don't don't agree so fast with me. i don't know she's having a good time i don't know about this one <laughs> well, that's fantastic so you know fantastic uh, thank you <laughs> i'm being brainwashed folks please send me help oh my goodness man so once again we have to announce i'm gonna let you announce kiki where people can contact you? They can contact the me card? at, no. Okay, you better have it memorized. I want to make sure. <laughs> Geeky at flantasticdesserts.com. Um, or my uh, webpage is a flantasticdesserts.com. Very good. And you're also on Facebook. I'm also on Facebook under Chef Kiki or Flantastic. Okay, there it is. Page. And the phone number is 562-665-5115. Once again, that number is area code 562-665-5115. Okay, write it down. I'm not going to repeat it. So I want to know that's going on. And Sylvia, how do they get a hold of the credit union? What's the number there? <laughs> yeah, see, this, I love this. I Why love did this you number. ask me that question? Okay, let's, let's, <laughs> we'll try the other one. How about the water company? The water company, I do know, 626-448-6183. One more time, one more time. 626-448-6183. See that? <laughs> See, everybody learns as we go along. This is, this is a learning curve, folks. You know, that's what we do here in Almonte because we love what's going on. Uh, we also got to give a shout-out to our patron saint, uh, Mayor Pro Tem, Juventino J. Gomez, who's one of the strongest components of this channel here, and also a great supporter of what's going on with the veterans. You know, he's the one that helped uh, promote that uh, homeless housing for some of our vets, you know, because they're our brave heroes and they've been well overlooked. And he's a man with a great big heart. And all the other city council members, we love you dearly. Victoria Vicky Martinez, Bart Patel, Norma Macias, and of course our mayor, Andre Quintero. You know, they're all wonderful people. Let's get a round of applause for those people because, you know, they support us here. <laughs> you know, See, and I want to make sure that I don't leave anybody out. And uh, just all our great staff here that we have here. You know, we have uh, new new faces on the on the set. We have Valerie. A round of applause for Valerie right there. She's working two cameras. Just like Sylvia does two jobs, she works two cameras. 
And then we also have Denise, who made it in. I'm so proud of us. A round of applause. <laughs> and the master blaster of the out of control room, Diego, is here for a man. <laughs> so while I'm going over here, I'm going to interview uh, Mr. Robert Colvin, of course, because he never gets a shot in the sun. They always just put him in the rain. I'll never forget that day. They have the poor man in the rain, man. I tell you. Well, some people. I'll let these ladies get back to their normal lives. Thank, Thank you once you again. Okay, and I expect to see you on the 30th when we have Bob DeSena, okay? You got it. Thank you. All righty, ladies. Okay. Don't no, don't forget to unplug yourself. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I had somebody do that. They got up and they walked over and went, Ugh. Okay, let me get on this side, this my my uglier side. Okay, let's round of applause for Mr. Robert Colvin. I'll have to get this way because I'm cutting you off. Okay, tell us a little bit about yourself, Robert, because, you know, I think you've been grossly overlooked for all your specialty talents and your renaissance abilities. Well, I'm a, a civil engineer for the uh, Caltrans for the highway department, and uh, this is my hobby. This is what I live for is to play music. Yeah, hey, round of applause, please. That's wonderful. Can you imagine it was the other way around? He was a saxophone player, and then he was a civil engineer. Then we know who to blame for Caltrans. <laughs> so how long have you been uh, working as a civil engineer? I've been out in Los Angeles for 25 years this year, this summer, 25 years. Wow, man. And you came from where? I remember you were telling me you were from an out-of-towner. From Birmingham, Alabama. Wow. So where do you consider home now? Both. <laughs> oh, man. we got another guy ready for office here. I don't know what's going on, man. I'm, I'm being, you know, sideswiped here by a lot of people that are coming up here. My guests, hecklers in the audience, and now even our talented saxophonist, you know? So... What is the future for Robert Colvin? I know you're at every event we have. Even some events, I wasn't even invited. You guys, you guys had like the Christmas lunch in, and I found out after, man. Jamie, so tell us, Robert. Well, I hope to expand on the, uh, the current platform that I have now, which is Sax for All Occasions. Uh, City of Amani has been very, very good to me as far as uh, acquiring my services for their events, which I really appreciate. But I hope to venture on to more activities um, uh, starting uh, on the 25th of next week uh, in Doherty uh, at uh, Cuisine on the Green, uh, I'll be doing Friday night jazz there. So that's going to be going pretty much every Friday night. Uh, I'll try to promote that as much as I can. So I hope to, uh, and also I have some other ventures with the, a Filipino band, South Coast uh, Rhythm Band, based out of Orange County, as well as Railway HD, based out in Victorville. That's a long drive, but it uh, gives me a chance to play as much as I can. Well, that's what we need, man. You guys go out, give a round of applause. This man... Yeah, jack of all trades, and he's doing it. You know, man. What would you think, Arlene? She was wonderful, huh? Absolutely, it's great. Hey, you ever hear a voice like voice. that? Love the voice. It's great, huh? Yes. You should hear it. She did one with uh, the great saxophonist Gato Barbieri. She sent me this video. It just blow your socks off. So I said, man, whenever we can, we want to see if she can come in, at least do a number with you, man, because you are just you're off the hook, man. Seriously, you know, you should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> Seriously, there are so many people walking around with no talent because this guy has it all. Except for, except for the fantastic. Except for fantastic. That's right. Did you get a chance to taste the flan? I'm saving it. I don't want the flan in here. I want to enjoy it in here. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Diplomatic, you know. Let me tell you, man. And then you can enjoy it in here. Wow. Yes. Hey, hey. You're not the only one smooth around here, dude. You do smooth jazz, but I'm smooth. I've been working with you for a little while, so I'm picking up a few pointers. Oh my God. <laughs> well, we'll try to break you of that <laughs> as soon as possible because we don't want that going. Well, you know what? We love having you on. Hopefully, like I said, if your schedule permits, we'd like to at least have you on once a month because we're doing three shows a month now instead of our four. And, uh, you know, have some other some other backup singers maybe come work with you and some other musicians are going to be dragging them out. And uh, I hope you're down for that, man. I am absolutely thrilled about that. Hopefully I can make it at least once a month. So I plan on it. Yeah, we want that. This man's been here. We counted like six times already, you know, and we really appreciate all his help and stuff. He would have been here for our Christmas show. But, you know, he was hired. They wanted him back in Washington, D.C., playing for the president. You know how it is. Eh? It was either me or Obama, you know. And <laughs> so, you know, but now we know what the diplomatic problem was with the financial cliff. But we, we love having you on there, and thanks a lot, Robert. Thank you. I appreciate it. Well, thank you. Okay, if you guys can follow me, we're going to be closing off the show right now. I want to hear a round of applause for the voice of Almani, Jamie Neary, please. That young lady works for El Monte and she, in the city of El Monte, and she also comes up here and devotes her time after work when she was, I mean, when she's all pooped 
And she does our brilliant announcing, and God bless her for what she does. Okay, I'm going to ask uh, the Out of Control Room if they can give us. You know, you know what? Let's go with Robert Cole. You want to do one more song for him? Oh, the G-Wiz. Oh. Yeah, we'll go Robert Colvin here. Okay, so I want to thank everybody once again. We want to thank um, Arlene Chavez Mendoza for doing her song. Give a round of applause. <laughs> Chef Kiki from Fantastic. Don't forget to contact her, 562 665 Five one one five. She has flan for every occasion and every flavor. So you want to contact her? And of course, my good friend Sylvia Miranda from the Credit Union and the Water Company. God, man, don't give her another job. She has too many. And I want to thank all our our guests. And I want to thank everybody there. Somebody knocking on our door. Somebody wants us. And that's also Valerie's mom. So. So we see you once again. We're going to close out with Robert Colvin. I want to thank you people for Almani tonight. And I want to remind you once again, be good to each other. Do not drink and drive because we want you back next week when it's once again time for Almani tonight. This is Arturo Esparza signing off. Take care. God bless. Take it away, Robert. <laughs> Thank you.